Hello guys, uh, Create Tutorials here, and uh, in this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to use uh, 3D Stroke. Um, yeah. So if you don't know what 3D Stroke is or you don't have it, um, I'm actually going to give you like a uh, like tip how you can get it. Just go into Google and search. Uh, trap code. Actually, I will just put this in the description. Uh, suit 11. Is click on the link in the description. Is go to this. Uh, and click free trial and just download this. Um, download the tra trap code suit and then the trap code 3D stroke uh, and then you submit. And you should get that. Um, and don't tell me, guys, about serials. You have a search bar here on YouTube. Just search it. Thanks. Okay. Um, so let's go on with the tutorial. And why won't this close? Okay. Okay. So I have some uh, things to show you. Okay. So this is the like. Um, this is what I'm going to be showing you basically like like that thing um, this this is a 3D stroke with Starglow and you can do pretty much whatever you want on this thing but like I'm going to be showing you the basics about this um, yeah so I will show you a little bit uh, things that you can might be interested on uh, yeah, like you can try to uh, RAM preview this. Uh, I think this is a really cool effect. If you don't have it, uh, go and download it. I think I think you should actually. But yeah, yeah, that's the effect. Uh, like comes in to like uh, this part goes visible and then the 3d strokes comes in and then yeah this is just what I made in like 10 seconds nothing really cool or anything and this is a target thing for no scopes or whatever like zooms out and then comes like a target thing and then it shoots but uh, you can do this a lot of nicer if you motion track the target thing and uh, like so it's there all the time not like so it flies up but yeah I'm just here to help you not do the work for you guys and this is a really cool point thing like uh, you see here comes like a point and it sweeps over to the, the green here and then he shoots and once again you can motion track this on the green like here uh, but yeah you can do a tutorial on that but yeah if you, only if you guys want it um, yeah so I'm just gonna go to layer or composition new composition and just uh, tutorial I'm gonna call it and then just make it 10 sec long whatever um okay so drag your clip in um to to your composition uh just make it exactly long okay so what you want to do first is you go to layer new uh solid uh, and you want to search uh or you want to you wanna write it or rename it to 3D stroke. Uh, yeah, and then you wanna go and you search it after you have downloaded it or have it or whatever. 3D stroke trap code, yeah. And then basically how the 3D stroke works is uh, by the pen tool. Um, 
that's basically how it works so whatever you draw on the uh, pen tool uh, the 3d stroke follow is follow it uh, yeah like this if I draw something really nice here oh my god look at look at this so nice okay um, and you see the 3d stroke is there <laughs> Okay, so the thickness you wanna turn it down to about three. I think it's cool, or yeah, three is probably good. Let's change the color, and I personally like I like a green, green, yellow, like that. And then you wanna go to the tapper tab and click enable. That will do so much. Just promise me. And go to the feather and you straight it. Up a little bit too, about 25 maybe. Okay, and uh, go to the motion blur and click on on. Um, yeah. So now you're probably wondering, how the fuck could I could I get this? And that's basically the star glow. So I will be giving a uh, giving these settings away but I won't take any credit of this because uh, I downloaded ta Rob Tasers um, um, like presets uh, and then I just change it around the settings because I didn't like it 100% but I'm not definitely taking credit for this but yeah so now what you want to do is just go to the uh, file that I have in the description uh, you just wanna drag it in oh that was wrong okay yeah but you just wanna drag in this I will have it in the donor link as I said and then just change this around to whatever color you want yeah like just change around whatever you want and you can go to the star glow and go to the strength the street streak length and straight up if you want to make this kind of nice thing I like it to five and boost light to about three yeah uh, and then drag on the thickness to about five actually but now how to actually keyframe this don't don't worry about that um, not to keyframe this like if we say I want it from there then you just click the keyframe drag it to minus 100 on the offset and then click U and then go about 20 or 15 frames forward drag it to 0 and then we get like like that, it looks. It, it just from zero to a, to a hundred basically. And I just go the same forward. I just drag it to a hundred, and then it disappears. So like now we have like this. Yeah, it just disappears. Um, now to make it nicer, just highlight the keyframes and go to keyframe velocity if you if you're on CS6 but if you're on CS5 just click F9 and then enable motion blur so it's much nicer but yeah guys this was just uh, the basics how this actually work um, as I said if you want like targets or points just make a new um, solid and make a new 3d strokes uh, like that and I draw a point so that 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 and this is I'm so good at making points I know right <laughs> okay I'm just gonna make this purple purplish and a thickness 5 or 6 actually maybe 
Then the tapper on. Arm shoulder on. Yeah, so. Uh, yeah, basically how I did this, like, thing where, where it kind of swipes over. It's. Um, you want to go on the 3D stroke and you want to go to the transform. And you just want to basically. Ah, it was with this. No, wait. Wait, let me find it. Here you go. The Y rotation. I think. Yeah, I, I think it was that. I, I'm not sure. Yeah. But yeah, you just mess around with these settings. It's pretty cool effect. And then as I said, just add the star glow on. And I have that link in the description. But as I said, this is totally um, uh, Rob Taser's pack. I have nothing to do with this. Uh, okay, guys. If you want more 3D stroke tutorials, if you want to learn how things works and like maybe transition uh, how you how you can actually do this like I made here just leave a comment below and I will make them if you want guys want them so I'm out peace